adding fractions with unlike denominators. Denominators are the bottom numbers in a fraction. In this case we have 7 and 2. We cannot add them until we change to common denominators. The common denominator is found by multiplying the two denominators. 7 times 2 is 14. Our new denominators will be 14. How do we change 2 sevenths to 14 We multiply by 2 over 2. 7 times 2 gives you 14. 2 times 2 equals 4. But why did we multiply by 2 over 2? Because we're multiplying using the form of 1. When you multiply 1 times any number, it may change the way it looks, but it does not change the value. 2 sevenths and 4 fourteenths have the same value. They are equivalent. Now, what do we multiply 1 half by? What do we multiply 2 by to get 14? Correct, 7. So the denominator will be multiplied by 7 and the numerator because 7 over 7 is a form of 1. 7 times 1 is 7. 7 times 2 is 14. When we add 4 fourteenths and 7 fourteenths, we get 11 fourteenths. Notice, when we add fractions, you only add the numerators or top number. Okay, now, when we add mixed numbers with different denominators, we do a very similar thing, except we bring the whole numbers over first. So we bring the 3 and the 4. To change to a common denominator, we multiply the two denominators, the two unlike ones. 9 times 5 is 45. What do we multiply 4 ninths by? We have to multiply it by a form of 1 because we don't want to change the value. So we multiply by 5 over 5. The 5 came from here. 5 times 4 is 20. And of course 9 times 5 is 45. What do we multiply 5 by 9? But we multiply the whole fraction by a form of 1 9 nines. 9 divided by 9 is 1. It's a form of 1. 9 times 2 is 18. Just checking to see if we're right. 5 times 9 is 45. And now we add. 20 plus 18 is 38 45ths. 0 plus 8 is 8. 2 plus 1 is 3. We only add the numerators, or the top number of the fraction. And then 3 plus 4 is 7. I want to tell you an interesting pig fact. A lot of people think pigs are slow, but the average farm pig can run a mile in 7 minutes. Can you do that?